here. You really saved my ass. I can't thank you enough. What about the ride? You gonna fence it? Well, I have to sooner or later. Know a guy in Sacramento, a collector? He'll set me up for life. Oh, but for now, I'm taking her with me. Spruce her up a little more. Wouldn't stick around too long if I were you. Sixth Street are gonna be searching high and low for this beauty. I'm leaving town today. It's like Uncle Estevez always said. If you gotta choose between your ride and saving someone else's ass, always choose the ride. At least you know that a ride's never gonna betray you. People, on the other hand, But, uh, this, this isn't the bar? It is. But it's our bar. Get up! Let's take a walk. Hey, leave him alone, cabrones. Si. Hey, back off. Hey, to be here. Bar. You heard what Pepe said. Take a fucking walk. Chew, fuck off. Or I implant my blade in your ribs. You really think you're fast enough with that blade? Really? The way I see it, be a smoking hole in your chest before your neurons even light up. But hey, nothing like a little experiment, right? Hey, come on, baby. That was the workout. Yo, fuck you! Carajo! Fucking punk! What? What just happened? Landed in a little trouble. Cleaned up now. God damn, sorry. I, I think I've had a little too much. Fuck, what a night. Why? Why'd you help me? You would have caught a beating. Yes. This fucking town, these people? Just here, minding my own business. If it weren't for you, I'd... Here, for your trouble. The rest, uh, bartender got the rest. Circling him like sharks on the scent of fresh corpo blood. 
could have ended badly if you hadn't stepped in. Me. Yeah, well, not all heroes wear capes. How about we drink to you then? On the house. Won't say no to a free drink. To good fortune and prosperity. Long day? Could say that again. I'm on a double. A break. Working overtime to make an extra buck? Nah, just don't want to go home. Ten years married, you know? Ten years and suddenly I'm not good enough. No, she has to go get some side action. Anyhow, since you brought up money, you wouldn't be looking for a gig, would you be? Pay solid. Run me through it. It's about my wife, right? Name's Cynthia. She's cheating. I'm sure of it. Only question is, who will? Could let it eat away at me. Or I could get someone like you. Ain't no more than an evening's work. Gonna have to keep tabs on your wife. Follow her around town. Where'd she be now? She works nearby. I'll give you the address. Knowing her, she'll be on a smoke break. Smokes like a goddamn tire fire. Like half this city. Well... But today, she was wearing a pink jacket. And, uh... Hmm. She had a blue purse, I think. Colorful. Always like dressing up. Get a woman something nice for her birthday, anniversary. And what do you get in return? Sure she's cheating on you? Let's start with the fact that she always stays late after work. I know she's lying. Called her office one night, she wasn't even there. Besides that, well, we got a kid together, right? Doesn't even look like me. Different hair, different eyes, all of it. Used to be easy to check these things, but with today's tech, there is a way around every test now. Why do you want to know who she's with? What's the point? What's the point? What kind of gunk question is that? Simple one. Answer it. I want to look him in the eyes. Ask him how it feels fucking some other guy's wife. Breaking up a happy marriage. Okay, fine, I'm in. You're my hero, V. Means a lot to me. CD Barr's betrayal of the guiling woman sounds like something out of a pulpy noir thriller. Pepe was used to listening to his customers' complaints, but now it was he who needed to get something off his chest. It was the same old story, an unfaithful wife in a city where everything was uncertain. You about done? I'm trying to focus. on the scene, looking for the woman in the pink jacket. The woman with a sordid past. Stop right there. It was her, the lady in pink, breaker of hearts, framed by a halo of cigarette smoke. I followed her. 
Dreaming of the day the narrator put a fucking plug in it. Got too close. Almost scared the dame off. Better be careful. I know, I know. around. Something weighed on her. Maybe it was my gaze. Keep this up, I'm gonna fucking puke. Narrate that. is a bum. Gives him a wide berth. Doesn't want her clothes dirty. Her conscience is already dirty enough. Oh, seriously, what did I ever do to you? Disappeared into the guts of a building ready to collapse. The air hung heavy with smog and betrayal. <sighs> Maybe it's a good thing I'm dying. <laughs> 